Hi everyone, my name's Bill and welcome to my channel. Before we get started, please consider subscribing to my channel and possibly becoming a Patreon. This video is going to show you how to set up dual rates in your Radio Master T8 Pro. Now, dual rates allow you to have a more sensitive aeroplane, so when you're in the air, you could be doing aerobatics and you can be doing flick rolls and all sorts of really fancy stuff. But when you want to come into land, you want the control surfaces to be a bit softer, so you can switch the dual rates on so you don't over control your plane. Now, this is not difficult to do. We are going to have to add in um, some lines to our ailerons, but let's switch over to the T8 Pro and I will show you how to do this. Now let's set up the dual rates. So I'm going to hit the model button and I'm going to go across. We're in the correct model that I want to use and we're going to go to inputs. Now we are going to have to add in two lines here. So I'm going to set actually full rates and then two others to show you on a three position switch. So we are going to push edit and I'm going to go down until I get to the switch. I'm going to push enter. Okay, oh, so okay, let's come back. We just need to push enter once and then move the switch into the position we want it. So that is going to be default full rates. Okay, and then we're going to go up and we will leave the weight at 100. So that would be the full throw. So if we push now return, and we come back out. Now we need to add a line in. So I am going to go hold the uh, enter key down and say insert after. Okay, now we are going to move down here and we're going to change the weight. Let's say, let's make it 60%. Sorry, I'll hold the button down so we can get there quicker. Let's go 60%. Okay, now we're going to move down and we need to go to the switch now. Go back up. Just push enter quickly and then flick the switch into the middle position. Okay, now we push return and return again. Now we are going to push enter and we're going to say insert after. And we're going to move down to the weight. Let's put this in at 40 now. Let's go down. Forty, and then we are going to move to the switch. Push enter quickly, and then flick up. Now, if we return out of here now, we should. If we watch the top screen, there would be this would be uh, this is switch SC in the four position, and we'll have full throw. Then we go to eighty, and then we go to forty. So you can see that coming down. Now. Let's test this. You can see we've got full throw on channel one and channel four. If I click the switch to the middle position, we've got less throw and then we've got even less of a throw. So we can adjust this mid flight. Now I've set up the dual rate. So I'd like to show you on my test rig. So we're in full rate, but you see there's a problem. I'm now banking my plane right. So this aileron is going the correct way, this one here. But that one's going the wrong way. Now this is on channel five. I can see it going into the receiver. So what I've got to do is go and reverse this. Now we need to do that, not in the inputs. The inputs must stay the same. We need to reverse it in the mixes. So we go down to channel five. Oh, whoops, a daisy, a bit of a pardon. We go down to, ch to channel five, we push enter, we edit, and all we need to do is change the weight to a minus figure. So we are going to go right round. Whoops, too far. OK, and then we just push OK. So we change it to a minus. Now it should work correctly. There we go. We bank right, we push that side of the wing down, pull this side of the wing up and vice versa. So I just wanted to show you that that depends on the way you've orientated the servos within your model aeroplane. You will have to choose whether it's a plus or a minus figure. So uh, I want to just uh, share that with you. So if we right now we can see we've got full throw. So we need to just watch one side. If I click, so we've got less throw 
and if I go to the second dual rate, we've got even less. And obviously that will work both ways. We get up. And there we go, demonstrated. Thanks for watching this video and if you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and if you have any comments or questions, please leave them in the comment section below because I'd love to hear from you. Thanks for watching. Happy flying. Bye for now.